is a 738 Fargo in Lehigh Acres. It's located in Mirror Lakes. Right off Mirror Lakes is right off of uh, 82, which would give quick access to Fort Myers. Okay, so the outside is painted. They're still, and uh, just keep in mind, they're still kind of, it's still kind of like under construction, so so to say. This is a foreclosure they bought that they're fixing up. And uh, the backyard is fenced. It's got a larger chain link fence on it, connecting to the neighbors. And from what I hear, the neighbors are really nice. It's got a newer roof and a newer AC unit. It's not brand new, but it's, it is newer. And the power is not on here yet, so it's it might be a little dim in here, but I'll try to explain as best as possible. So when we're walking in here, get a, give you a look at the front doors. Walk in here, in here to the living room. The square feet is just under 1,800 square feet. Uh, of course, everything you see here, this is all going to be tile. Um, flooring and all through here and they're doing wood laminate in the den which is right here now you could make this a fourth bedroom you just have to add a closet and that pretty much makes it a bedroom put some solid doors on there but so let me give you a full view here there's also a side door that goes into here these are the back bedrooms it's a split floor plan so the master bedroom is on over over to the left side, and the uh, the guest bedrooms over to the right side. So we're walking in here. This would be the living area. Of course, that's the kitchen, and there's the den, and there's the the other back guest bedroom. So this could be a little dining area right here. The the kitchen here is obviously. A wreck at the moment. They're gonna do like a uh, a tile cabinet or a countertop on here. It's kind of hard to see the island here because uh, it offers a little more space than what it seems. And plenty of counter space. The cabinets, as you can see, they're the older style. Just kind of plain, nasty looking. Those are gonna get replaced with a raised panel uh, doors. And I believe the appliances are either going to be stainless or black. And it's something that uh, if you wanted stainless, I could probably negotiate that for you since the stage that we're in. So there's the dishwasher. That's where the dishwasher is going to be. Obviously, the stove, microwave, and fridge. You have extra counter, uh, cabinet space over here and drawers in the island. And let's take a look at the back bedrooms here real quick. This is the back guest bedroom. Closet. Again, everything, this is going to be carpet in here. This is going to be carpet. And, you know, we'll take another look. We'll save this video and take another look in about 10 days when they're going to be done with it. This is going to be tile in here. This is the guest uh, bathroom. And it connects to the den and it connects to the front guest bedroom. I think that toilet's going to be replaced. Get some light in here. There we go, and then there's light. Okay, so kind of like a standard kind of tub shower. I'm pretty sure they're leaving that. I didn't say anything about it. Okay, and this is going to be carpet in here as well. It's the same type of closet with the bifolds. All right. And this comes out to the front entry. Back into the living. Okay. Let's go back here towards the master bedroom. To the left is going to be the laundry room. It's really dark in here. And the garage looks like a garage. 
<laughs> I was in there. It, see, it has a security system, but I don't know how out of date it is. It might need some updating. I'm sure it does. Um, but anyway, here is the master bedroom. It's pretty large. You could you could fairly easily fit a king size bed in here. Depending on which way you're facing it. The closets over here. Uh, okay, so it goes deeper in that kick in there. And that's that way again. Uh, I would definitely put some shoe racks there for the wife down towards the bottom. That was the old carpet that was in there before. And I believe they are putting carpet in here. I think they said they're doing carpet in all three bedrooms. And then doing the wood laminate in the den. <clears throat> here is the master bathroom. Let's see. It's got a large soaking tub. There's the commode. And walk in shower. And a little linen closet. Okay. And the house does have uh, a storm shutter ready. The storm shutters are in the garage. And let's go out back. Let's take a look at the back of the house. Let's see if we can get out here. Okay. I don't have to see if we're gonna do anything with this with this back here. They're obviously gonna they're gonna have to paint it or put tile out here. I don't, usually they put tile out there. Anyway, so this is the backyard. And there's that big chain link fence and there's the neighbor's fence. And they still have a little bit of painting yet to do in the back. So that's the back of the house. There's room for a pool if you want to do a pool back here. There's definite room for that. And the kind of cool part about this house too is it's city water, city sewer, so you don't have to worry about the well water. It doesn't have uh it's not well. Like usually the other ones out in Lehigh are all well. This is on the city. And I think take a look at this side again real quick. Sure, we didn't miss anything. I think that's it for this one. It's gonna be nice. I gotta rescreen this lanai. It's loose. It's got holes in it and stuff. Probably get rid of this lattice. And that'll do. So we'll keep this video and we will check it out in about 10 days. Thanks for watching.